What is up team? Today we're gonna be doing a really cool and super awesome experiment. In a past video, we threw a foam glider off the highest point in the Santa Monica Mountains, which was Sandstone Peak. Now that video did really well. Uh, as to date right now, it has over 400,000 views. And so we wanted to think of a way, like how would we, you know, like make it bigger and better? And so the one thing that came to my mind actually met me via email, and then I was like, wow, we have to, we have to do this. And so what happened was this. My boy Wolfie right here. What's up? Hey guys. Uh, he works for this company called Will's Wings, and they're a hang gliding company, hence the giant hang glider right behind me. And uh, he was like, hey man, you should come out, you should, you should check out hang gliding. And I was like, cool. What if we toss the glider from the hang glider? And he was like, uh, yeah. That's a very good idea. <laughs> so today we're gonna learn all about hang gliding. One, how it's done, how these things operate, and then two, uh, we're gonna see if we can get our foam glider to go the world's longest uh, foam flight path. It's gonna take a tandem hang glider uh, designed to take two people and mount that somewhere on the side so we can launch and fly normally and then if we have enough altitude, we're just gonna toss that thing up. All right guys, so here's how these things are made. Uh, the first step is you want to construct the sail, like the part of the glider that is the thing that's actually going to be the wing. So that goes through this whole process. It's all custom built. Uh, you can actually custom order the colors, the fabric, the whole shebang. Then we go over to like the machine shop area where they take aluminum chunks and they cut them into exact pieces. And then there's also tubes that are from Switzerland. I love Switzerland. And that gets constructed into the frame of the wing that creates the airfoil. And then you put those two together and you have essentially a bird. Uh, I'm feeling very good, very safe, uh, considering how much expertise goes into each little piece of the hang glider. So, Will's wing, really cool, very interesting, very impressed with their whole production. Now we're gonna go out to the launch site, it's about an hour from here, and uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna fly this uh, foam airplane uh, from a hang glider. Puppies! Yeah, you're a good dog. We are now at the second location of the day. This is actually the landing pad for the gliders, the hang gliders, which maybe will even be our foam glider. We're gonna test the foam glider out here just to make sure we get everything nice and right. We're thinking is right in the center. It's kind of what we did last time. We got a little updated camera here, a little Hero 5. Test flight number one, just to see how it's gonna go. So pretty nose heavy. <laughs> Way too nose heavy. All right, let's move the GoPro back. We're gonna go directly into the wind. Right, one more? Yeah, give it another shot. Oh, oh God, it's just so good. I get so excited about the littlest things, but I'm so excited about that. It's so good. All right, now we're gonna tape the living crap out of it, get it actually prepared for its maiden voyage. And then we're gonna take another transport from here up over on the other side of that mountain. And then that's where we're gonna start our flight. So we made it up to the top here and uh, this looks absolutely terrifying and amazing at the same time. This is gonna be awesome. Sit right in, it's gonna sit right in the wind and just fly along with us. Perfect. It's getting realer and realer. I just got my helmet on. The glider is set up. And we're gonna get on out of here. Sweet.
going down. You really do feel like a bird. You're like a bird. You run off, you fly, and then you land back on your feet. It's weird. Like we spent so much time in the air, man. I actually like. I feel like I feel more comfortable in the air, and I feel weird on the ground now. I would rate this uh, 150 out of 100. It, it, in fact, it ranks in the top 10 for the top 10 coolest things I've ever done in my entire life. We're gonna go up to what is known as the 750. It's like the training spot, and that's actually where our little glider is about. Seatbelts. Safety number one priority. We're gonna drive up to at least that ridge and then we're gonna get out and we're gonna go into the wild and we're gonna find that glider. So you saw this from the sky. Uh, this is about where somewhere over here. Actually, I think I can see it from here. I think that's it. All right, dude, let's go get it. It's like bushwalking. <laughs> This is what is known as going off the trail. One thing that we have to our advantage is that since we launched it from the hang glider, we had eyes on where it landed. And so we have a much better idea about where this glider is. I can see it already. All right, guys, so there it is. Right there, boom. It's still recording! Oh my god, yeah! Nice! <laughs> that is so sick! Yes! Sick! That is so perfect. Alright team, it's still recording. I cannot wait to see this footage. Oh my god, yes! Oh, that is so perfect, dude. Dude, that is so sick. Oh man, that is so great. Oh, that is so awesome. There we go. So that was a world's first, a foam glider from a hang glider. Can't believe it worked out so well. The experience from all day today was, was awesome. It was super awesome. Really. So good. Wolfie, where can we find you, man? Um, on YouTube, my name is Wolfgang Sias, and same on all social medias. Dude. Uh, 100% thank you so much. Make sure to subscribe to his channel. His latest video will be in the end slate. Um, so good, such an awesome time. Uh, if you guys like this video, go and give us a thumbs up in the comment section below. Let me know, one, were you surprised we got this airplane up on the glider, and two, how long that flight was. Uh, if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys really soon.